Everything we see around us is matter. Matter is made up of tiny particles. Today we will explore the characteristics of particles of matter by doing some experiments. So we will see four characteristics of particles of matter. Particles of matter are very very small. For this I put a drop of ink in water. So a small drop of ink can color 200 ml of water. Increase the dilution by adding more water into the solution of ink and water. We still see the blue color. The particles of matter are very very small. Particles of matter have space between them. Take 150 ml of water. A sugar grain is made up of large number of tiny sugar molecules. Put some sugar grain into water. Dissolve it. You can see that there is no rise in the level of water. Here the sugar grain break into tiny sugar particles when they dissolve in water. And these tiny sugar particles occupy space between the water molecules. That is why the level of water does not rise. This experiment proves that particles of matter have space between them. Particles of matter are continuously moving. Let us do an experiment for that. Light up an incense stick. We can see the smoke spreading on its own. Soon the smell will spread across the room. This is because the particles are moving on its own. We'll try another experiment also. Drop some ink into the water. Don't stir. We can see the blue color spreading on its own. So from both the experiment we have proved that the particles of matter are continuously moving. Process of mixing up of particles of different types are called diffusion. Particles of matter attract each other. Can I break this metal spoon? Definitely not. Here particles of matter attract each other very strongly. Now take a piece of crayon. I can easily break this. Here the force of attraction between the particles is weaker compared to the metal spoon. So particles of matter attract each other. 